There are thousands of LMSs out there and e-learning platforms and technologies in general. So it can be extremely hard to figure out what LMS, AKA learning management system, or e-learning technology is right for you and most importantly, right for your learners. Well, if you are creating an e-learning program, online course, or virtual training that you are selling to your learners, so you're externally distributing your program to your learners, you're marketing and selling it to them, then this is the video for you. Welcome to the e-learning simplified YouTube channel. My name is Johnny Havey. I'm one of the co-founders of e-learning partners, and we created this YouTube channel to simplify your e-learning so that you can create value for your learners without worrying about all of the pieces that make up an e-learning program, online course, or virtual training. Now, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and we have a free giveaway for you just because you are gonna stay to the end of this video today. And at the end of the video, we are going to tell you what that free giveaway is. All right. Let's dive into our favorite learning management system for external training. External training or external e-learning, meaning that you are building your e-learning program, online courses, or virtual training to sell to your customers, to sell to your learners. Much different than internal training. Internal training being creating e-learning that is meant to train your teams. You can use this LMS, Kajabi, for either market, but you're going to get the most bang for your buck using it to sell to your customers. As you can see here, there's a lot of marketing copy here. We have a link, by the way, to Kajabi in the video description below. So check that out. <laughs> Depending on when you are watching this video, you may be able to get a 28 day free trial instead of a 14 day free trial of Kajabi just because you used our link. So here's what we got. Kajabi super cool because it is a learning management system and a business management system all in one. What does that mean? That means that you have a system where your courses can live and you can also manage the entire sales and marketing experience that your leads who you're trying to sell to so that they convert into learners, it's all taken care of with Kajabi, which in the end tends to save a lot of money because otherwise you have to piece all these things together. And when you have a learning management system that doesn't have sales and marketing integrations natively in the system. Now you have to spend money on a website. You have to spend money on lead pages. You have to spend the money on email marketing, payment processing, all of these different pieces that Kajabi just handles natively. And as you see here, it's very inexpensive. So we recommend, by the way, when you're checking out any learning management system. Like we said, 14 day free trial here, but if you use our link, depending on when you're watching this video, you will be able to get an additional 14 days, so a total of 28 days of free use of Kajabi. That's enough time for you to mess around, build your course, build out some marketing and sales funnels, and testing it on your learners. And what we do recommend is to start paying monthly because you don't want to have to commit to a learning management system and spend the couple thousand dollars a year on a system that hasn't been tested on your learners. So you still want to make sure that you start with the monthly packages. So as you see here, the basic package goes for 150 bucks a month. The growth is 200 and the pro is 400. The annual discounts do bring these down. The basic being 120 a month, the growth being 159 and the pro being 320, but you have to commit for a year to get those discounts. You can see kind of the differences between the packages. We pay for the growth package for our courses because we're not really limited by much with the growth 
package. We're actually probably going to be moving to the Pro soon as well, but really no matter what package you start with, you're going to get a ton of value. And the most important thing is that when you have Kajabi, you not only have a learning management system, you have a sales and marketing system as well. All right, let's log in. Give you a quick tour. Here we go. When you log in to Kajabi, what you're going to see is website, products, sales, marketing, people, and analytics. Let's go through high level. When we go to the website, this is where your website lives. So depending on how your company is set up, it may make sense to have your entire website built in Kajabi. But if you already have a very nice website built out, what you can do is use the Kajabi website functionality to actually build a standalone website that promotes your course or online university. Pretty cool. As you see, there's going to be different themes here, really similar to WordPress. You can go to pages. You can create pages that hold the settings of your entire website, or you can create landing pages that have their own unique settings per page. What we mean by that is if you have like a top menu header and you want it on all of the pages on your site, all of that design is going to live on the website pages. Now, if you want to create a page that lives outside of those design choices that you make, that's where you build out landing pages. And then Kajabi has this cool thing called pipelines too, which we dive into in other videos. All right. Navigation, this is where those menus are. So you can have your top menu, you can have your footer menu on your website. <clears throat> you can have a blog. A blog is really important and set that up as well. I'm moving through this pretty quick. This is just the basics of Kajabi. Go to products. So products <clears throat> is where your course lives. So when we create a new product, go oh, create a new product, blank mini course, online course, drip course, membership, community. These are the options of the products that you can create. Pretty cool. What you'll most likely do if you're watching this video is you're going to create an online course, but you can use the blank, the mini course, or the online course template. So Kajabi recently launched the ability to also use Kajabi to manage your podcast build out. So that's where you have your podcast product here. So coaching is pretty cool as well. What coaching allows you to do is you can build out full consulting and coaching programs within Kajabi so that your clients, business or individuals, have their own portal to log into where they can log into and access all the online courses that they purchase from you in addition to your consulting and coaching and other services you're selling them as well. All right, sales. This is probably the most important part of Kajabi is in sales, this is where you can build your offers. We have a lot of videos on our channel that talk about how to build your offers. Offers being what all are you selling in addition to your course or what value is your course in general to your learners? Like what is that? What is the value stack that your course is showing to your target market for them to buy? So that's where you can really set up these different offers, different pricing tiers, etc. Then we have coupons and set up coupons. This is payments. So payment processing all is done through Kajabi. Affiliates. This is where you can set up your own affiliate marketing natively in Kajabi. So let's say you have a course, you're selling it for $1,000. What you can do is have affiliate links for your partners to send traffic to your sales funnel that you create. And what's going to happen is Kajabi keeps track of where those leads come from so that you can then pay out an affiliate percentage for that course. So if your course costs $1,000, you could set up affiliate percentage around 40%. You pay your affiliate $400 for each course that is sold. Then we have the marketing tab here. Marketing is where all your email campaigns are going to live, your pipelines. A pipeline is really an A to Z sales funnel built in Kajabi. It's really cool how they map it all out too. We'll show you that in another video. Automations, this is where you can set up tags and all these different things that interact with one another as your 
students enter your funnel and eventually become paying learners. Forms, this is where you're gonna set up those lead capture forms. And you can set up different lead capture forms for different courses, other products, etc. Really cool, all lives here. People, this is where you keep track of all your leads. So the people tab has all of your contacts that are in your Kajabi CRM, your customer relationship management system. It's gonna have all their tags, it's gonna say what products they've bought, it's gonna say what emails they've read, etc. And then we have assessments. Assessments are going to be related to your courses. You can create assessments to figure out the learning checks based on comprehension of your learners. And then analytics, this is gonna give you everything you need to know about the sales of your course, the lead management of your course, how your learners are engaging with your course, Pretty cool, pretty comprehensive. So all in all, this video was just a high level overview of the basics of Kajabi. The main takeaways are if you are creating an externally facing e-learning program, which means that you're selling a product, you're selling your courses, you're selling your program as a product to your learners, then what you wanna look for is a learning management system that not only hosts your course, but also has all the other infrastructure to manage the sales and marketing of your course. Otherwise, you're gonna to have to piece in all these different things that Kajabi just provides natively, and it's gonna end up costing a lot more than 150, 200, or $400 a month. Now, you're probably wondering, how do I know if Kajabi's the right learning management system for me? Well, great question, and guess what? We're at the end of the video, so here's our free giveaway for you. We have a free masterclass you are going to get instant access to when you click on the link below this video, type in your email, you'll get instant access to it. The masterclass is all about how to guarantee the success of your e-learning program, online course, or virtual training every time you build one. And really what we go over is how to define your learners, define who they are, and maximize your e-learning business strategy so that you are choosing the right LMS, you're building out the right content, and in the end, you are providing ROI for yourself and your company, and more importantly, value to your learners. So definitely check out the link in the description below. That's gonna help you really figure out, okay, this is the learning management system I need. This is the type of content I need. Now, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel. If you really wanna check out Kajabi, we have that link in the description below as well. Check that out. By using that link, you're showing support to us and our channel. We appreciate that. Hopefully you get that 28 day free trial as well. And you know what? We'll see you in the next video. When you first saw a Lightboard video, or maybe this is the first time you're seeing a Lightboard video, you probably thought to yourself, wow, that is a really cool trick. Well, the reality is there is data that supports why you should create Lightboard videos. Should you always create Lightboard videos? Not necessarily, but there are some major metrics that make Lightboard video content a key type of content to create for any e-learning program, online course, or virtual training. Remembering that it really is all about your learners, and we will get there today.